everyone, this is Miss Paige Dell. I'm coming to you to do an unboxing of some items that I got from an uh, from a company that I've only used some of their facial uh, products and I've had the opportunity since then to actually visit one of their stores. But prior to my visit to their store, I wanted to show some things that I got and you know, when we talk about customer service and how customer ser what customer service means and how important it is, I really do feel that it is. So, I ordered from Lush Cosmetics. And I've started using their items over the summer. I, I started watching some YouTube videos and I was very impressed by the um the reviews that individuals had, you know, pretty much had shared on face on, on um YouTube. So I purchased this item. Well, and it's called the Nightingale. And a lot of the items bursting with bath time time delights to help you relax and unwind. So there's like like 20 bath bombs in here and uh, well different bath items that's in here and so I've actually recently you know was able to use some of the items because um, because somebody just kept talking about them and so with this order with the nightingale I ordered some items I ordered the big blue and if you see it's shooken up a lot and you know where it's really crumbled so if you've never um, used any of lust uh, cosmetics items um, they can easily break or crumble I guess that's fair to say and then I purchased the golden wonder now and that's how it looks when I got got it and I actually think this looks like a cake if that makes you know they smell oh wonderful wonderful and i got the little snowman yeah and i bought also twilight and so it's crumbled up it smells good i'm telling you and i bought the butter ball so and also that came in that in, in there was the um the snow cakes soap bundle so I purchased two of these and so these are okay so all of these were all packaged and they had them packaged inside the item in the in a box but I think the weight of the nightingale box pressed down on the other one through and through shipping and it caused it to shake and crumble and whatever so uh, when I received first when I placed the order it was sometime in November and I received it like the first part of December of this month and prior to receiving it it had been a while and uh, and I was just I called them to follow up on my um, my purchase my order and when I called customer service they were very friendly very friendly and they was like oh you should have already received that item and I was like, yeah, I'm just making sure because I know it's Christmas, you know, starting to be Christmas and normally my postal, um, postal man, they will leave things on my, uh, uh, my porch and which is, which is fine. I've been in my, uh, my home for, for the last 10 years. And so I really have had like an incident a couple of times. Um, but other than that, things can just sit on my porch like a whole weekend, uh, or even longer. Um, so I called them, they reimbursed me for my shipping because they was like, you should have already received it. And so then like, um, two or three days after the call, I received my items, which was in route, you know, in route to my home. And I, and I opened up the box and I was like, and I explained to them about, you know, everything. And these are like Christmas gifts. What do you think they did outside of when I called earlier the first time? They reimbursed me my shipping, and then when I got my 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 um, order, and I told them what had happened, they was and I told them it was like for, uh, Christmas gifts for family members, and they were like, "No problem. Tell me what it is in your shipping that got damaged." And I told them what the items were, and they were like, "No problem. We'll send that out right back to you." And pretty much that's what they did. So now, here's my cake, my birthday cake. Is that not cute? 
So I have that. And my big blue came the way it's supposed to be, not broken up. As well as my, oh, that's one that didn't get damaged, the sex bomb. So that's one. So it was some in there that didn't get damaged and some did. And then Twilight. So here it is. It's all shipped in, you know, looking the way it's supposed to look. And yeah. So uh, I contacted them and they didn't have a problem. So when I say it pays to have great customer service, it it's wonderful. And um, I will shop from them again. I've tried their... Uh, I think this is my first, the Dark Angels is my first product that I've used from them. Now, since it has, it smells like a char charcoal, and um, and I will say this, I like it. I pretty much put it on my face um, and while I'm in the shower and then, you know, and uh, rinse my body and everything after, you know, washing my body and everything and I let it just sit on my face and I just, you know, after going through my wash and everything and then I rinse it off my face. Um, I have the herbalism, herbalism and I have like two containers of those, the small ones, and I'm trying to get in the process of trying to use those and I really stopped and I, and I, I prefer this one, but I know since I purchased it, this one, it has, I think the texture has changed. And so for you, for those who are very experienced with using um, Lush uh, Cosmetics, Give me some feedback in regards to, to the one that has the free preservatives, fresh preser fresh preservatives, preservatives free. So let me know because it says made by Shelton and on uh, on August 22nd, it should be used by November the 22nd. So should I discard this one because of that? And I'm thinking... Yes, but then I want to know for sure because if not, I can continue to use it because this is like a brand new container that's been sitting in my bathroom and I wonder if, I, if it's best just to put them in the refrigerator. But anyway, so just let me know. Um, um, so yeah, that's all I have to say in regards. It's just good customer service and who doesn't love good customer service? So if you've never experienced uh, Lush Cos Cosmetics, try them and I hope that you like them um they're really cool they're really good so anyway talk to you later have a great one Merry Christmas to everyone bye